Hi, I'm Charlie. I'm the owner of Shadow Vale Studio and also the creator of the modular gaming case. So this case uh, can help you carry your models and your paints and tools. Uh, and we're gonna, gonna go over some of the bundles that we do and all of the trays and what they can help you with. So this is the first of one of our trays. So this is one of the painting trays, as you can see inside the box here. This will house uh, 35 Citadel paints or 70 drop bottles and also can hold various other things and that's why we left it nice and open for you so it has whatever you wanted. This is the parts drawer that we do um, and this is just a nice space to store all your little bits, maybe your spares of your sprues, base, extra bases, anything like that can go in here. Um, the dimensions of each tray are on the listing um, but yeah it just helps tidy your box up a little bit more. This is the troop tray, and with the help of some of my Silverneth here, we're just going to demonstrate that you know, with some decent magnets, um, they're not going anywhere. Um, so this is a metal plate that we use on the top of these instead of any of the sort of rubber um, or ferrous sheets that you see, um, which are widely used now, which aren't particularly good uh, holding the miniatures. Um, so yeah, you can get four of these or three of them in the case, depending on what configuration you want. Or if you've got something really big, you can always just keep two in there. So we're just going to borrow this one out of this setup here. So this is a little drawer for all your brushes and tools. You can see in there that it's also deep enough that it will house your brush soap, um, glues, and various other brushes and uh, accessories and things. And it'll also hold a tin of paint. It will take the larger tins of 500 milliliters as well. And there is plenty of space on there. And also if you want to know what maximum is, again, that's on the website. So now we're going to talk about some of the bundles that we do. This is one of the first bundles. This is the dropper bottle bundle. I know I've got Citadel paint in here at the moment, but there is enough headspace um, for all your dropper bottles of various size, be that Vallejo, Army paint or anything else. Um, you get two drawers in here that will hold 140 dropper bottles. And then we've also got the aforementioned tray at the top where you can store all your brushes and your, and your primers and things. Um, this is the configuration for this one and we'll move on to the next one. So this is our second painting bundle. This is specifically for Citadel paints and it will receive four painting drawers. And again, will hold 140 Citadel paints. This one, it doesn't matter which ones you've got, whether it's the regular basin paints or all the way up to the washes. Um, and if you really want to, you can always replace this top tray with a tool tray. So you've got your primer in there as well, but this is what that bundle holds. So this is our bit of everything bundle. So you've got the tool tray that houses the primer and uh, the tool drawer. Then you've got the parts drawer here. You've got a tray for Citadel paints. Unfortunately, this won't house uh, the Vallejo paints or drop bottles in uh, this configuration. And then you've got one troop tray at the bottom as well that will house anything up to about 60 millimeters, allowing you a couple of mil full clearance. So this is our next bundle. This is our troop bundle, so exclusively for carrying troops. So you've got three decks of anything up to 60 millimeters with the upper deck being slightly higher than that at 65. And this is the four tray troop bundle. So this is our second troop setup. So you get three trays with this one and using the alternate runners in the center of the case, we create a lot more space for anything. So, you know, the larger elite models all the way up here, still able to house those smaller ones, but we brought the silver nets today specifically because they are pointy and fragile. Um, so you can see you get um, two different levels here and that 65 at the top. All of these are individually listed on the bundle listing, so you can see your spacing on each one. Thanks for watching. This is a few ways that you can set up the modular gaming case. There are obviously many, many more. Um, and if you don't see the bundle here that you want, each of the trays can be bought individually. Or if you want a little bit of help setting up your case, reach out to us on social media or on the website. Um, make sure to give us a follow to stay up to date as there will be more trays coming out very soon. Thanks very much.